Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting to the final three episodes of Real Life. Okay, so before we even get started, this journey into this show and, you know, my journey with this show and other things, this, this has been a really crazy roller coaster. And it it's a little surreal that this is over because, I mean... <sighs> It got done so quickly. And it didn't really feel like that, even with the fact is there were some weeks that I couldn't film it um, because of so many other things that I had to do and ish and that. And it's like, it, it's so funny because I'm thinking about this. I was like, this is over by today, by the time I record this. And at the same time, I'm about to start something else in the next few hours. I'm still debating on it as of right now, but who knows? Probably by the time you see this video on Friday, I probably have the answer to it. I don't really know yet. But, um... <laughs> It, it is a little surreal, and the fact is that after this, there is nothing else with this, and it's kind of sad, and I, I just really hope that we get a happy ending for these two, but something just tells me in the back of my mind, like, these are going to be the last few moments that these two are going to have together and being with each other, and then once they become older, they may not, you know maybe want anything to do with each other but let's go ahead and get started with episode two <laughs> of the OVAs in three two one go Unfortunately, yeah, because I need y'all to confess to each other about the fact that you're both adults. Please. I just, I need a good ending. I need a good ending on this show. I really do. Like, because this shit, <laughs> this stressful. Stress between this <laughs> and the situation that's about to happen in the next few hours. Like, what? <laughs> And the fact that I'm probably going to have to wait. Oh. Maybe a couple more hours. I don't really know. That's the thing. And it's like. Oh God. This is hard. When you're thinking about so many different things. And you're like. Hmm. Should I watch this to please myself? Or to please others? And such not in that way please don't think that <laughs> it's really more of like should I watch this show strictly just for me um and because I love it or should I watch it on my own 
or should I make a reaction on it for people to comment on something every single week, but then they might comment on me because of course. So, ha, <laughs> it's just complicated. It, it's very similar to how I felt so many years ago about doing reactions on AOT and mm, we ain't got time for that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay. Mm. Yeah, how is that gonna go though? No, that's fine. So let him spend time here with you, babe. <laughs> oh God, are you going to ask him? Cheese it up. Oh. <laughs> oh, come on. Just go along with it. So. Oh.
Well, dang, that's it. I was expecting them to, like, you know, we would see them walk around and do stuff together, but no. Huh? Uh, Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah, I'll still be here. Excuse me. <laughs> yeah, you don't always need someone watching you, you know? <laughs> yeah. I mean, because at the end of the day, the biggest thing is, are you going to tell him how you feel about him? <laughs> this is the hardest thing for both of them, honestly. Yeah, but you have to make up something. Mm -hmm. yeah. but you are already an adult you're just you're relieving uh, reliving this so that you can take these certain things that you've already learned and use it in your adult life Mm-hmm. Mm. Same thing with cheese, I do. But you don't know that.
Are you insane? No, because he's made friends with these people. It's almost like... <sighs> There's so many things it could be like, though. I got a bad feeling about this. Bye. So they won't even remember that they both fell in love with each other. But they should at least remember that, though. But still, though... Ah! <laughs> Ugh. 
I swear to God, if this show ends sad, I think this will now officially be the number one, like, saddest ending show that I have ever seen in a while. <laughs> and I really don't want that. Exactly. <laughs> because of the fact is you don't want to part from him and you want to be with him. You love him. Mm -hmm. Oh God, it's getting more and more real. I'll just probably erase you two out of it. Well, of course. <laughs> uh huh, sure, baby. <laughs> Because it'll all be gone anyway. Mm. <laughs> oh god this just hurts and we only got two more episodes left <sighs> this is just and I'm, I'm happy I'm saying this now this is like the, this is the beginning of the end I really want these two to confess to each other, but if they do, it's just, it's game over. And I understand of why they can't do it and such, but, like I said, I really, I got a strong effing feeling that this show was going to end on a really sad note. Like, I mean, this might end, like, fucking angel beats or plastic memories sadness. And I really, I, I don't want to experience that. Mm-mm, 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 no, because... <laughs> this is why I will I, I've told people I've like many of the reasons why I can never rewatch Angel Beat and I can now officially as of watching Plastic Memories almost about two years ago um I can never rewatch that show those two shows are just too damn sad and it feels like we're going the same route with this show and because of the fact is we only have two episodes left and how anything purposely can happen with these two and, and like just everything anything can and will happen that's the saddest thing it's just about how is this going to blah, blah, blah. how is this going to conclude with these last two episodes specifically like with Adita and Jizuru's relationship like when they do become, you know, their older selves again, let's say they're just walking past each other and they just have a feeling. There's so many things they could fucking do with this. But it's just at the same time, I am so freaking scared because I'm like, bro, what the hell are they about to do? Or what could they do? 
there's there's a lot of possibilities straight up but just knowing that like both of them are having are feeling the exact same freaking way like i can't i freaking cannot <laughs> it's like uh it's too much <laughs> I don't want to watch the last two episodes because it's just going to make it real and I don't want that. But go ahead and pause the video and I will see you guys in one second for OVA 3. Okay, OVA 3 in 3, 2, 1, go. Also, I didn't say this in the previous one, but she looks so cute with glasses. Oh my god. Like, okay, so since this is supposed to be a date episode, what if she, yeah, my money's really more on she's to do, like, possibly saying, like, hey, I'm not actually this age, I am actually this age, da 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 da, da and then, boom, end. <laughs> Bad end. <laughs> oh, God. Something's gonna happen. <laughs> so Yeah. Mm. No, of course. <laughs> well, you know, you go walk around, you take her out to like a really nice restaurant. Oh, you so precious. Yeah, don't worry about it. But they're not dating, though. I mean, yeah, it's nice to spend time with a friend on that time, but... <laughs> Yeah, 
Uh, there's complications that you don't know about. Unfortunately. Are you okay? She's uh What the fuck? <laughs> oh my god. Baby is avoiding you like the plague. <sighs> you know the answer. Mm hmm. Well, it's better than running out in the cold. <laughs> She is. <laughs> oh, I can't. No, next month. <laughs> De <-do. laughs> I, I mean, you know, she asked you. 
Congratulations, baby. But I, I know it's a little embarrassing to say it like that. So, of course, I understand why she wants to go through text. <laughs> She's comfortable like that. And that's okay. Give it a minute. Maybe two, right? <laughs> She asked you. Yeah, but other things like what, though? The mark you left on them is not really enough. Just probably maybe like what the lessons that he's taught everyone. But still... Yeah, so what do you want to- oh! <laughs> Aww. Okay, do you just want to wing it? <laughs> Christmas! You want me alone on Christmas? Yeah, I get that, but no one wants to be alone on Christmas. <laughs> True. And it'll look cute at the same time, because of course that's what we do.
<laughs> well, it's your job, right? Don't be sad for them. I'm trying not to cry. I don't want to cry. Exactly. You'll remember for them. <laughs> hmm? Oh, but are you going to get her something? To match. It's a match. Aww. <laughs> Aww. Stop it. <laughs> I know, yeah, he only did that to tell him, but still, that's sweet. But you will though, both of you. I am screaming so bad in my head right now because I hate this. <laughs> I'm not gonna cry. I'm not gonna cry. It's not the last episode, so I can't cry yet. You are. You are. Oh, fuck. I'm crying. Oh. 
They go in right there. Oh. No, I think she's going to say it. That's it. That's really how we ended it like this. Even though we still got one more episode left. But in a way, this right here, it it felt like the true quote unquote ending and we're just getting something extra. But, uh, okay. Now that they finally have told each other their feelings and they're now dating and such, like, Oh, what's gonna happen? But I'm happy. Like, oh, I was scared. I really thought they were going to save the confession for OVA 4. But oh, oh and he has it on his phone. And she has it on hers. Watch, because they're gonna show it. Oh, my God, this show. This show has. God. This this is the oh, I can't speak emotional roller coaster. There you go. There's the words, Deja. Emotional freaking roller coaster. And we're not even done. <laughs> we are not done. The last episode is next, and I'm just scared. But I'm happy. But I'm so sad at the same time because they're not gonna remember this. <laughs> I just, I want to just, you know, go into the last episode and just skip. Just to see how in the world this ends. Because this is some bullshit. Like, seriously. They finally both confessed to each other that they loved each other so much. But now, because we're going into the final act of this. And because this real life is really almost over these two are not going to remember each other unless unless something happens to the point where it's like oh hey you know they pass but we're gonna let them remember ish but i don't think they're gonna let them do that because you know <laughs> life but i'm just i'm huh. i'm everything there you go everything 
every little emotion in the book right now. I'm happy, I'm sad, I'm scared, I'm a little anxious, I'm nervous, I'm excited, I'm everything, every freaking thing right now, because this is just, it's too much, <laughs> it's just too fucking much, and I can't. Also, happy December 1st, because it's already 12 5 in the morning, my time. But just, oh my god, I can't. I cannot. <laughs> I can't, no. I really don't want to watch this next episode, but I gotta, I gotta see how this ends. I, I, even if it's sad, and you made me tear up, even if it is sad, I want to be happy. No matter what the heck is going to happen in this last episode. I just want to go in, finish it, be happy, say my final thoughts. And just, you know. And then, well, I ask myself, am I going to watch the show again? Because right now I don't know how to feel. Oh, God. But go ahead and pause the video and I will see you guys in one second for the final episode. Okay, final episode in three, two, one, go. Uh. I don't want no opening. I just want to just continue. There we go. That's it. That's how you start. Baby smiling, she's smiling, I just smile. Yeah. Oh. Which is Yeah. Oh. <laughs> huh. Well, thank you, Amazon.
It's different. Oh, God, I hate them so much. But you will, though. You both will. Damn it. <laughs> Yeah. You did a lot of things. Mm-hmm. 
Exactly. <laughs> Unfortunately. I just, I wish that they could have just told them what they got. You would think she would, but... Been out of chaser. Ah -ha! What if they apl work at the same place? Bruh, no, 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 um, okay, in a way, I've already put that in the universe, so fuck it. God, there's going to be like a big high chance. Mm-hmm. Mm. 
This hurts so much. Wait, 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 wait. Okay, we got seven minutes left, okay. I was about to say. Are we going to see who it is, though? Okay, let's go ahead and do this now. All right, final thoughts on this show. Okay, I really enjoyed this a lot. At first, this was a very kind of what I would like to say slow paced show. Um, usually depending on what it is and depending on like how I feel with like maybe the first few episodes, sometimes there are shows that are really good at their slow pacing and then there's ones that like they take a little too long. This was kind of one of those shows. It's very similar on how I felt with the first few weeks of, um, recovery of MMO junk Junkie, but I still loved that show by the time I finished it and did a reaction on it. But this is still sad. Like, these two are never going to see each other again. So, it hurts. It really, truly hurts. Y y once again, yeah, you gave me my angel beats and freaking uh, plastic memories. Like, those two shows made me cry. This made me just tear up a little bit. But still, it's still sad. It's good. I really enjoy this, but it's still sad because we'll never see each other. Ah! Uh, <laughs>
Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. That's how you win the fucking show. Oh my god. <laughs> because for a moment, for a straight moment, oh my god, I was like, <laughs> they're gonna walk past each other and. Oh fuck. They were gonna walk past each other and just like, mm, yeah, we're, we're just co workers and that's it, but like, oh. Oh god, this show was really good. I. Dude, I, oh god, I don't even know what else to really say, but it was good. I mean, between this, Plastic Memories, and a recovery of an MMO Junkie and freaking Angel Beats, like, could I possibly see myself watching this again? Yeah. I, I think from how I felt at the beginning of watching this from the last three, from special to to now I, I feel a little different because I was speculating that we were going to have a really sad ending for this and that these two were never going to see each other again but the fact is like <laughs> I'm happy but continuing on my final thoughts like I really really enjoyed this show even with everything that was going on and being very complicated with some weeks of not being able to record this and other things and it's just that and third everything you know jumbled up hot mess and everything I, I really enjoyed this this was a very good anime I think probably maybe in my opinion this would be very underrated I felt like it, it really did feel like that a lot this kind of series it felt like maybe only uh, probably maybe even at the time when this was airing um this was the the show that, you know, was very underrated that only a few people knew about. Um, it didn't blow up. So whatever was airing at the time of with this show, of course, whatever blew up on that. This was like one of those where it was under the rug. Only a certain people knew about it. And then it kind of blew up maybe probably a season or two after where people were like, oh, hey, you seen this? Or maybe even towards like... Um, the end of its run. It's kind of very similar how um, with last year with Akadama Drive because of the fact is like Jujutsu Kaisen was airing and as someone who was hella excited to see Kadaka's work, you know, because because uh, Duncan Ropa fan, bitch, me. Um, I was super excited about it and so I was skeptical to see how it was going to go and everything and so by the time I think we got to probably the halfway point of that show, that was when the popularity of it skyrocketed, a lot of people were talking more about it and I was really happy because I, as someone who's been known for Danganronpa getting to be known for something else was really good for him and his career and such. But this was a very interesting show. Had some very sad moments, especially about Odyssey's past and with his previous co-worker and everything. I do kind of wish we got um, maybe like a quote-unquote spinoff for like Chizuru and her situation. I mean, yeah, you got it with like the, la like <clears throat> the last two episodes of the initial first part and then these four specials you get that 
you get to see a little bit into her past and the fact that she failed her first real life and then she's doing it over again for a second shot and then her meeting Adita. But what I would have liked to see is maybe take 12 to 13 episodes with her as the POV and we get to see every little thing where she messed up at. And then we get that second POV of her meeting Adita and everything else. This is that and the third and her experiencing falling in love with him. I do like the fact that with these final four special episodes, we kept going back and forth with certain moments with them where we got a little POV of Adita and a little POV with Chizuru back and forth. That's kind of how I would have wanted it to see. It's almost like where there have been some animes where you get to see that through both lens of views and so you get to like kind of agree and disagree on how somebody was feeling at that moment and such which I'm not mad at but oh god <laughs> I, I really like I said I really personally enjoyed this I, I think I will miss this a lot because especially how it made me feel from the last like from where I started to where I finished and everything else in between it was just a damn good show very very good very underrated like I said um I think this will probably be one that maybe I'll watch with my mom, but at the same time, because of the fact is I gotta pay money money on Amazon Prime, because of course, um, I think this is the first like 12 episodes are free, and I think the other ones, of course, I gotta pay for, so <laughs> I don't know, maybe I might show this to my mom if she wants it, I think there's a dub for this show, I'm not 100% sure on that, I have to check, but um, yeah, I, I think she would enjoy this, but the yeah, my little nitpick about it is was the pacing. I mean, it was really, really good, but that I think like the first four episodes and pacing wise, and a couple other episodes, the pacing was like eh. But like I said, overall, I still really enjoyed this a lot. So yeah. Other than that, guys, that is my reaction view towards the entirety. Of real life. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Magical Squad. <laughs> and of course, I will see you guys for what the heck I'm doing next. Because it's now 12.38 and I'm still deciding if I am going to make a reaction on this show. That will officially be out in like the next few hours. Like I said, probably by the time this comes out on Friday. Um, I should have an answer on said show <laughs> I don't know all I know is that in the next few hours the first 12 episodes will be out and I'm like <laughs> should I stay up should I go to sleep even though I stay up anyway but once again thank you guys for joining me on this journey and of course I will see you guys all next time bye